so once you have checked all the boxes for all three of the sections and selected the article and paragraph for each one and in the withholding rate boxes you have selected 0% reduced treaty rate your screen should look like this and then just press next and then all the information that you've just input there will form a list and you can just double check it to see that all of the above say 0% reduced treaty rate if any of them don't say 0% reduced treaty rate you have the option to go back and edit it and make sure they all say 0% reduced treaty rate if all is okay it's fine to continue the next part is activities and services performed in the US it says has and your name performed any activities and services for Google within the US or do they expect to in the future and select no then check the box that says I certify that the services provided to Google or its affiliates will be performed solely outside the US and that any labor or capital including facilities or other tools used to provide such services will be physically located outside the US yeah so check that one then press next in this part you'll be able to choose your method of receiving the document either online or via post and me personally I prefer to get my documents by post so I scrolled down and then I selected get documents by post uh, do which one is comfortable to yourself and then it says your documents will be sent to your registered mailing address then I press next after that, it shows a document preview with some links to click on. I suggest you click on each individual one and have a look at it, read it thoroughly. And then if you're happy with the information, then you can check the box that says, I confirm that I have reviewed the generated tax documents to the best of my knowledge and believe they are true, correct and complete. So you check that box and then press next. After that, you will see certify and sign. So I suggest you read this section in full thoroughly. Make sure you understand it. And then when you are happy with it, then check the box at the top where it says under penalties of perjury, I declare dot, dot, dot. <laughs> it's a bit long for me to read all that. Yeah, you get the gist. <laughs> then after that, read fully the unchanged status affidavit, understand it, and then... Once you're happy with that, check the box below to certify. And then after that, a box will appear below with the generated date of 1st of January, 2020. If you press on the I icon, it says, if you cannot use this year, please provide the year that you started business with Google. So for me, I used this year, which is 2024, and that worked fine, but it's up to you. You can either use 2024 or you can leave it as it is. It's up to you. I used 2024 and it worked perfectly. So just use 2024, which is this year. Yeah. <laughs> After that, 
scroll down to where it says your signature read all the information thoroughly you'll see that your name has already been auto filled and once you are satisfied then select yes i am the beneficial owner named in the tax identity section and then scroll down and then press submit and then it says your tax info has been accepted all done status approved and then if you were to log back into your google adsense account and click on the go to payments it will now say your tax info for united states has been accepted woohoo <laughs> and then if you'd further like to double check you can go into your gmail and you should have received an email from google payments telling you that your tax information has been approved and there you have it i hope you found this video very useful and if you find anyone else struggling to fill out their google adsense tax information for 2024 please pass on this video also feel free to check out our playlist section we have duplicate adsense account error fixes for that and we have google adsense playlist and we also have demonetization and appeal successful appeal for demonetization in the playlist so please watch that as well and we also have other interesting content in our playlist sections please do feel free to check them out and don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you found value Thank you so much. See you on the next one, guys. Bye.